Mel Brooks's The Producer's Stage version, Beyond Brilliant. Every night when you and Martin Short were exiting the stage after an exhilarating performance, what did both of you do to come down? Uh, we cursed each other because <laughs> uh, I dragged Marty into that show. And as Carol will tell you, when I first saw that show, and I, and I loved it. I loved it. I saw Nathan and Matthew do it, and yes. I went, it's, this is brilliant. It's better, it's better than the movie. It is better than the movie. And, and I remember saying to Carol, somewhere, someday, they're going to ask me to do this. Please <laughs> remind me that I don't want to do really? this show. And the reason I didn't want to do the show is that it goes back to that Hamlet thing. I didn't go into this to be a comedian. It, mm -hmm. it became the mainstay of my life. And I love doing comedic characters. Here's the problem with the producers. There's nothing under it. There's nothing under it. It is just the jokes. It's like spam a lot. It's just the jokes. And they are jokes that are written in Mel Brooks's musicality. There are not a lot of ways to say, I'm wearing a cardboard belt. That's how you say it if you want to get the laugh. And if you go, oh, tonight I'm going to try to uh, express Max's, uh, you know, feeling of worthlessness and you, got, you can't do it. So theater is not straight repetition. Theater is a discovery every night in a good piece. The producers was straight repetition. And the only thing that broke it up was that I was working with uh, Marty Short, who is irascible and was determined <laughs> to crack me up every night. And he would, he would go to any length in order to do it. So my job was just to hang on while Marty took me on a run. So that part of that show was glorious. Working with Marty, working with that company, I loved. And, and doing a show that an audience loves that much, if you're a theater creature, that also feeds you. But the actual doing of the show um, was not my greatest cup of tea. It just was, once you learn it and once you do it for a week or two and you go, oh, that was fun, there's nothing left except to just do it again, and that's not my favorite kind of theater.